back to my channel. I'm so excited for today's video. I'm going to be doing a clean my room with me for the new year. We are doing it deep clean today. There are so many things that need to happen. Really quick, if you're new here, hi, my name is Grace. Welcome to this happy side of the internet. I make positive college lifestyle, the list could go on content. It's a really fun place to be. I do mostly vlog style videos and I have a very fun time with it. I just feel like me and you, we're besties over here. So if you are new, I would love you guys subscribe down below to join the family. And if you guys are not new, but you guys don't follow me on my other socials, my Instagram and TikTok, I'm being way more active on those this year. Those are part of my resolutions. I also have a podcast, change the caption of the podcast. I have a small business change the caption. Basically, you guys can tell your life to be busy. And with that comes my life can get very chaotic and messy. And that's why we have to deep clean my room. Today, I'm filming this a few days into the new year. And anybody else spend that week in between Christmas and New Year just letting yourself reset and just exist and not do anything? Because I know I did. So literally didn't like clean my room, put away clothes, put away Christmas presents like once and I need to do that. I also recently did a shopping vlog and if you guys watched that video, you know I really am wanting to like upgrade my wardrobe this new year. Anybody else have that the feminine urge every single year to recreate yourself and rebrand is truly there. You guys feel me on that? And so I need to sell a bunch of old clothes. I can't be bringing in all this new stuff and just like, you know, I don't need to just pile on top of what I already have. It's time to sell things. It's time to donate things. We need to go through it all so that's what today's video is gonna be it's gonna be a lot of time lapses of me cleaning a lot of chatty moments probably and I really just want to get my life in order I want to be that girl in 2022 and I want to have everything in such perfect order that my life just feels clean and my mind feels clean that's the best feeling you can have really quick last thing comment down below if I should do a deep cleaning of my apartment for the new year video because honestly y'all I love finals and my apartment is like a dump right now and I'm about to head back up and start my spring semester and I want to make sure I start on the right note so I need to do like a fridge deep clean I need to do a big grocery shopping trip I need to do like the deep scrub like those like TikToks where they show you how to do each like every tiny little like you scrub the countertops you scrub the inside of the sink like all those random chores I need to just have like the biggest cleaning day ever so if you guys like this video and you want an apartment version comment down below because this is my parents house bedroom where I spend breaks but my college apartment is honestly not any better so basically this whole week I just need to spend my entire higher days cleaning okay let's get right on into this vlog without further ado because i know i'm in a super chatty mood but i'm just in a good mood today life is good great things are coming let's get into this cleaning video all right y'all so we are going to start off with just fully exposing myself for how messy i have let my room get so you guys can kind of get a before image of what this room really looks like first of all i need to take all my christmas stuff down it's still up but okay my bed is made because i did instagram pictures for the launch of my podcast this morning but this is what was really going on behind the picture so this is really just like facts that instagram is not reality my room is literally such a mess i have like christmas presents all over my coffee cart it's so scattered this is the most none of these drawers are organized i like started going through clothes because i want to get rid of them and i just like got lazy and stopped and it's just so messy over here i have like christmas gifts that belong in my apartment so i really need to take them to my car this is a mess like what is happening up here i don't i don't know y'all it's a lot so I'm gonna start with like sorting through laundry, putting the dirty stuff away, putting the clean stuff away. And then like, I think I should do that step before I decide what clothes I wanna keep. Just kind of like start with like a basis of a clean-ish room so that when I make piles and stuff, it's not like, what is happening? You know what I'm saying? So the next step is to go through my clothes. I already have this whole bin of stuff I'm donating, whether it's too small or if I've worn it a bunch of times, whatever the case may be, I'm ready to refresh my wardrobe for the new year. So I'm going to go through like all, I have so many buckets of clothes in my room. We're gonna go through all. I'm watching YouTube while I do it. So it's honestly kind of enjoyable. Like I'm not having a bad time. <laughs> Some extra baby, I've been staying 
guys so a check-in I finished going through my clothes here I have a lot of clothes up at college and I also have some up in my office so just because I'm gonna be taking these to go sell them and also I'm going to be donating a lot of them as well I want to kind of get them all together so I'm gonna start by taking like the ones I have to my trunk and that's kind of like the next step for cleaning my room in general I want to get everything out of my room that doesn't belong in here that'll make it easier to like vacuum and clean the mirrors that kind of stuff so I came up with a whole trash bag of clothes here and I still have basically I want to be really tight on myself with what I actually keep that I left at school because like if it's been at home or like at my apartment for a month and a half because I came back here uh, as soon as finals were done I probably don't need it so a lot of the stuff I left in my apartment I'm gonna be getting rid of I want to just have a lot less clutter in the new year I think it brings you a lot more peace um, at, at my heart sometimes I can be a material girl but I know I feel better when everything is just like less cluttered and I just have the essentials so we're gonna be getting rid of a lot of stuff so I'm, I'm excited to get to my apartment and clean it soon but for today this is a really good start I'm really happy with having this full bag of stuff I'm going to also start making piles of my Christmas stuff and stuff that's going up to my apartment like let me show you okay so when I say okay first of all I have stuff like all over because I've been making like little piles anybody else do that when they clean their room I was trying to like put my fitness clothes back where they go but like this goes up to my apartment this is my like new podcast logo and I'm gonna have it in like my recording area in my place so like that's the core for there I'm not gonna set it up here batteries for it my parents have this blender that's literally why I asked her for Christmas, so I don't need it at my parents' house. So I haven't even unpackaged it from Christmas yet. I'm going to be using it at my apartment, so that's chilling here for now. I want to organize this space more. I really want it to just be, like, my skincare and makeup just sits here to, like, a clean space. A lot of this is, like, Christmas stuff. Or, like, stuff, like, obviously this needs to go somewhere else. But, like, this bag, and then I have my little, like, makeup bag down there. If those two could just sit here, I think that would be, like, so organized, sleek. And, like, I'd feel like my life was together. Um, this needs to come out of my room and then like so much of this this goes to my apartment my friend Izzy got me this for Christmas look how cute this is it says like little daily affirmations lots of Christmas gifts basically that are gonna be decor in my other place just because I'm not usually in this bedroom so I don't want to leave much here um, this I'm gonna take up to my apartment my little brother got me this for Christmas it's a random stuff but yes I'm going to get to it get to getting stuff out of my room this tree we're gonna have to say goodbye to but it's gonna be a lot less cluttered so excited for that all right so update time i kind of have some piles going on with stuff and i actually saw the place i want to go resell my clothes at and then whenever they don't take i'll take it to the thrift store it closes at 6 o'clock and it's currently 3, so I think I'm going to head there now. I also off camera went upstairs and went through my like upstairs like office closet and I came up with another bag. So we already have two bags of clothes to take. So I'm going to carry these out to my car, go drop these off, and then I'll come back and we will finish up with getting like all this stuff. And then I also need to do like the like wiping stuff down vacuum moment, but we're making really good progress. All right, y'all, so update time. It is quite a bit later. I'm actually just gonna set you guys down right here. So I was gone, I went and took the clothes and I ate dinner, hung out with my family for a little bit. And I was like, okay, we gotta finish this up. I still need to get my workout in tonight. So I wanna finish up with cleaning my room so that way when I come home tonight, I mean, nothing is better than like the feeling post-workout when you shower and do like your good old skincare and you just feel fresh. But like that combines the clean room chef's kisses so i want to make sure i'm coming back to a clean room tonight let me update you guys on a little bit of progress i made behind the scenes um it kind of looks like a mess but we actually are making progress you know how like you kind of have to make your room like messier to then get to cleaner you know okay so my vision with this came to be perfect so basically i have all my makeup in this pouch it doesn't quite zip because i have a lot but it's all stuff i use all the time and then i have my everyday skincare pouch deodorant and perfume so it's like my like one-stop shop for all my beauty stuff i like that it's like inside this basket so it's just very neat and tidy and then i took like my christmas stuff down from there also sorry the lighting's not the best it is like no more natural light so we're working with this one lamp but i have all my christmas stuff right here i'm still figuring out how i want to pack this away downstairs downstairs to make sure that next year it's like really easy to find it all because all these things are so cute this was my favorite decoration that I added to my collection this year. I think it's so adorable and I can't wait to get it back out next year. But for now, obviously all this stuff needs to go away because it is the new year. I don't know why my shoes are still on. Slide those off. And then right here, I've started packing the stuff that's gonna go 
up to my apartment. So I think I'm gonna try and use my suitcase to do the stuff that doesn't fit in this basket. But I figured I'd take up most of my purses and like all my light cups and some Christmas present stuff that I would rather have in my apartment because I'll use it all the time. And then I also have like a lot of random Christmas gifts and stuff that I've shown there. So I'm gonna pack this up. I am headed up to my apartment like I've been saying soon. So I figure I'd rather take some of the stuff that's not my everyday like work, small business stuff and everything that I have to take when I take like all of it back when I go back to school. So start out small. I might wanna make sure I put these in my suitcase so they don't get bent. This is from my little first solo vacation and I showed you guys this so cute and busy. So I'm gonna pack this suitcase up Watch that as I get survivor while I do it. And then I'm gonna carry all this out to the car to get out of my room. Alright, you guys, so update time. My winter coat is on because I took a bunch of stuff outside into the base outside and to the basement. So it was freezing outside. It's like under 30 degrees. But I just came back inside and finally put on the finishing touches. So my room is officially clean. I'll give you guys a little glimpse of it. Looking overall pretty good. This little pile of stuff wasn't there before and it's gonna be empty within a few days. That's all stuff I have to give back to friends or like this is basically clothes that aren't mine. So I put them there for now so they weren't in like a trash bag or something. My bed has some workout stuff on it, but all the drawers are like super cleaned out. Most of the decor stuff is down. It's looking really good. Like just having like all of this open finally is so amazing. I still have to take down the stuff up here in the garland back there, but both of those aren't as Christmassy, they're more wintry. So I still wanna leave them up for a while. I just mainly wanted to get like all the Christmas tree stuff and like a little Christmas decor down just so it felt more like empty and clean in here. But I am gonna go ahead and end this vlog off here because I am done doing my deep clean for the day. I'm probably gonna go in and do like some like mirror cleaning and vacuum type stuff in a future productive day of my life vlog before I head back to school. But I think it looks really good for today, especially compared to how it looked um, when I first started. And it's just so great to start your year like going through everything. Like the fact that I got rid of like two giant trash bags and stuff, I just feel fresh and ready to take on the year. And it's so much easier to get into like my morning routine and night routine in my space is like allowing for it. Like since I have all my little routine care stuff on that table, like it's just so much easier to find things and practice self-care so yes thank you sunflower so much for watching i hope you guys enjoyed this video if you guys want more organizing videos in the new year comment down below y'all support me and so, so so much to me and i'm so happy you're here and if you stay till the end comment down below comment down below green because that's really like off topic and random and we'll see who was the real one and stay till the end but yes i love you sunflowers so much and i'll see you in my next video Save me, I've been missing Lady Luck ever since she started.